Hey everybody, it's Joy Packard. It is the end of day one here at the uh, Legacy Builders live event here in San Diego. And whew, it's been a day. I just wanted to get on here and share a couple of my thoughts with you. Um, first of all, I brought my awesome new journal to this event to take, to take notes. Um, here's my new journal. It says new day, new mindset, new focus, new intentions new results. Hi, Joel. And um, lots of note taking today. I, I, I learned so much today. Um, and you know, one of the reasons that I came and, and there were like two or three other events that I could have gone gone to this weekend. And um, this is the one that I ended up coming to. And I have been trying to get clarity on some of the things that I been working on and you know many of you know I do e-commerce but I'm also uh, moving into self-development retreats and super excited to um, learn today and to get clarity and you know a lot of times whenever you're involved in doing a lot of things and I talk about this a lot at my events where we talk about mind mapping and you know putting everything on paper putting your thoughts together and trying to decide exactly where your focus should be and today, that is one of the things that I was able to work on, and it's it's pretty exciting. And I met some incredible people today at this event, and wow, you know, it's just um, been amazing. And again, it's all about the networking, it's all about events, and the different things that you can learn by coming. And you know, it may just be somebody that you're talking to, sitting next to, listening you know there was a, a few things today like if you even just were you weren't listening for even just a little bit you would have missed a golden nugget and i can i mean you know whenever i come to events and i teach this and and like when i come to events i like to put black rectangles or or something like that you know so that when i go home i can take this notebook and know exactly like what i'm supposed to work on and i have a lot of black rectangles and you know today one of the one of the exercises that that we were trying to do is to focus on a specific method on how we're going to launch you know whatever it is that we're going to launch and i wanted to pick like two maybe even three things and and my friend next to me said you know this is this is why we're here and that's to get the clarity and to to realize that you know it's important to focus it's important to focus on on one thing and to work on that and and so that has been, I think, my biggest challenge over the past year is because I want to do many things, you know, and, you know, whenever you are on this mission or you feel like you're on this mission to impact people, to help people, there are many things that come, you know, into, into your brain as to what you want to be doing. And so it's super exciting to um, narrow things down, to really think about the things that I want to focus on, the things that I want to do and um you know of course to do it here in beautiful san diego and to be amongst like literally 300 other people who are on the same kind of path and so you know i met like i say some incredible people that's going to change my business and i i just um it's been an incredible day wanted to get on here it's been a great report to you know to share with you and you know whatever it is that you're working on it's like if you are feeling like you need focus, you need clarity, you know, that's the kind of thing that I love. I love coming to events and it'd be like, a, you know, where they do different exercises to where um, basically it just kind of helps you, you know, with your thought process as you are trying to write down the things that you really want to do. And, you know, there are a couple of things today that were said that really stood out to me. And that is, you know, I know that we're in business a lot to earn money, you know, for our family, for ourselves to support ourselves, to support the things we're gonna do, but what then when you make the million dollars? And then that's where, you know, the impact and being able to um, do the things that I feel like I'm, I'm supposed to do. And so it's pretty exciting, you know, to, to utilize that, to be able to take what it is, you know, like, okay, so once you earn your money, then what? You know, you talk to a lot of people who are millionaires. You talk, and I mean, we're amongst a lot of people, six and seven, eight figure income earners today at this event. And once you earn that, then it's almost kind of like, now what do I do? And that's where, you know, the humanitarian ideas come in, where 
you as a person and making an impact comes in. And that's one thing that today I was like super excited to get clarity and to rub shoulders with people who, who can get you there. Because you know, it's like you can do things by yourself, right? But it's a lot harder than when you are amongst people who are um, high senate, amongst people who have resources that can help you. Whether it be, you know, I'm, I mean, there was a lady today that um, gave me her card and had a service that um, I'm gonna look into that's gonna help me, you know, like with, with what I'm doing. And so, I don't know, it's kind of exciting, you know, like whenever you are where you're supposed to be and you know you're supposed to be there and you're at an event and you say, you know what, there are people here that I know I'm supposed to meet and they're going to help me with my mission, with what I'm trying to accomplish, right? Because yes, like I say, money is great, but you know, once you earn money, like what are you going to use it for? And how are you gonna use your talents to impact the world? I know it's such a bold statement, you know, like whenever people say, well, what do you wanna do? And you know, it takes time to really think about it. Like, it's like, I know like what I want to do, but it's just kind of like getting the clarity and the focus to be able to implement that. So I hope you guys are having an amazing day and you know, we still have some networking to do. We still have day two tomorrow and you know, so many awesome things to learn. But you know, it's, it's like when you surround yourself in a room of people who are like-minded and who have the same kind of goals as you. And you know, you might say something that sparks their interest and you begin a conversation. Like today I met, um, I think like two or three people who live in San Antonio. It's pretty awesome and you know, we're talking about just having like masterminding going on, you know, whenever we're in San Antonio. And it's, it's kind of neat to, to do that, right? To, like I say, come to an event and then say, oh yeah, I'm from San Antonio. And then some, oh, I'm from San Antonio too. And it's like, I don't know. It's like whenever you put yourself out there and whenever you have the goals and the passion to accomplish the things, you know, that you want to do, then the things and people and things and situations and events are gonna show up in your life to where it's gonna help you to grow and it's gonna help you to accomplish that, so. Anyway, just sharing those thoughts with you. I'm still kind of like coming down from an amazing day and uh, always love to share my thoughts with you on that, you know, because um, it's, it's kind of like whenever you have something in your head and it's like, you know, you're in this motion of like, it, you can't sleep because you have this passion to get something done. And then when you come to an event and some of those answers and solutions are starting to be presented to you, it's pretty exciting. So anyway, I hope you guys are having an amazing day. It's so pretty in San Diego. We're staying here at the Marina and um, it's been an amazing um, day, amazing event so far. So I'll talk to you guys soon.